We have been living in a conflict for over 50 years now. We have two peoples sharing one land. I belong to the Jewish people who got its uh, right of self-determination, by the way, from the UN, recognized by almost all the countries in the world, maybe except Iran. We are right now in military control over another people sharing the same land with us. That's the basic fact, and we need to think how we can solve this. The best way, and we've been living in 50 years of violence around this conflict. Just two weeks ago, we saw another violent round in, in Gaza. I live in Tel Aviv, the biggest city in the center of Israel, and we had alarms to sit in shelters for missiles, and the south of Israel get even more in constant reality. The only way to solve this conflict in a peaceful and secured solution is dividing the land between two states, Israel that already, already exist and recognized, including our capital in West Jerusalem and Palestine um, next to us. And this can be achieved in an agreement, in diplomacy, in talking, not in fighting with each other. We can keep on fighting forever, but we don't want to. We want to change our course into a peaceful and secured solution. Um, we need the help of the world. Of course, we'll have to achieve it, you know, between our uh, leaders in the region. Um, but, you know, going back to the Ottoman and, and British mandate and history, uh, it helps us understand reality, but we need to better understand the future and look forward how we solve this, uh, this conflict. And actually, the solutions are on the table. They are there. We need a brave leadership to pick them up and make them a reality. This is what leaders should do for them.